So today I'm taking a look at this emotions wheel and in the package it does come with two of these which is real nice. Uh, I've got this little smaller one that's a uh, handheld that's going to be on the go. Also worth noting it does have little hole punched out holes over here. Uh, this is for it to be nailed against maybe a wall if you want. Uh, now this is made out of metal as you can see over here. Uh, it's not metallic uh, but you probably go ahead and just attach some sort of magnet to put it on the fridge as well too. That would be cool and handy. And these are going to be the exact same things. Uh, it just goes over a bunch of different emotions. In the center it'll go ahead and be a little bit more simplified from happy, uh, disgust, sad, anger, fear, surprise. And as you go ahead and go on the outside, uh, these words become a lot more descriptive. Uh, even words I haven't heard of or rarely hear of such as uh, detestable. And so this would be good uh, if you're working with kids, if you're uh, in social work, um, if somebody has trouble really expressing themselves or are unsure of what emotions they're feeling, uh, this could be a great way to go ahead and uh, further understand uh, which one it is. So like if you're feeling sad and you don't know why, you can go ahead and kind of go down the line. Maybe you feel uh, abandoned. Why do you feel abandoned? Uh, is it because you feel ignored? Do you feel victimized? And this just helps you understand a little bit more, not only that, but also to go ahead and learn a lot of different words that you might have not known before. Uh, one thing to note about this is, because uh, this was so big, uh, it kind of was uh, bent a little bit uh, when it came in the mail. I went ahead and just bent it back into place since this is metal. Uh, but yeah, that's a quick overview of the emotion wheels.